mostly on the wall you'll see kind of annotated kind of information like change this color here make this color different and this was really how Frederico worked in this kind of very kind of painterly collage cutting and, and drawing back into all these things and so is this actually how it looked in the Liberty studio when you know when the, when the design process yes, is in full yes, flow this isn't absolutely. sort of just a no this is an actual reconstruction. A absolutely. We, we literally pulled everything from the studio, from all the drawers, all the portfolios, and just brought it here and put it on the wall. So we have a mixture of like real original artwork that would be created, like the paintings, and then we've got strike-offs and samples from the factory. Um, we have kind of like collage bits and annotated kind of drawings. You know, things where we were, you know, you do your first set of samples and then you kind of evolve them and develop So are you doing, are you doing this so that you can actually sort of think whether the, the finished printed piece of fabric is sufficiently close to the colours and the texture yes. of, the, of the sketch? Absolutely, and one of the things we did with Federico a lot was all the kind of learning about the colour that he wanted in the collection. Um, really getting the kind of perfect dark burgundy or the perfect charcoal grey. Um, he talked a lot about kind of living colour and colour from nature that was alive. I noticed there are photographs of you, or maybe not here, oh yes, there are some photographs of you actually looking at some of the designs with Federico in yes. his place, yes. which is a garden in yes. Tuscany, as yes. far as I can see. So you're actually surrounded by the colours of nature there. Absolutely. We did so much work in his house, in his garden, kind of really um, in, his, in his real kind of environment, really, which was super inspiring. And, you know, he's got an incredible garden um, full of very beautiful plants. So that was very much part of it. So what was really exciting about the interiors collection is we built a kind of real variety of, of types of pattern in so that really always thinking about how they're going to be used in real spaces. So for example here we've got this as a real hero, this kind of really bold, beautiful weave and then always trying to think about how it would be used and what the quieter elements, so you've got kind of lovely kind of coordinate stripes, you've got planes, you've got semi-planes and it's these elements that really get combined in a room to really be kind of harmonious and livable. It's as if you're trying to get them to be as different, almost so different that you don't know that they're from the same collection. Yeah. But yet there's just enough there just enough to there. hold it together Absolutely. As, as a single statement or a single a single design statement. Absolutely, and it's, we often do that with colour, so that our colour stories, like for example the Chitona Green story, really does that and kind of links these disparate elements together, which is often a technique we use at Liberty to bring patterns together because we are very eclectic.